Hi, I'm Irv Rayfield, Dr. Rayfield. I'm one of the orthopedists on staff at St. Joseph's Hospital. I am the head team physician for Syracuse University, team physician for many of the high schools in the area. I'm a partner in Rayfield Sports Medicine, which is a division of RSM Medical Associates. I want to spend a few minutes with you explaining one of the newer techniques that we have in orthopedics called hip arthroscopy. Hip arthroscopy uh, has been developed over, mostly over the last 10 years. It's a recent advance. It's done by very few of the orthopedists here in Syracuse. My interest is, um, has been developed because it's a common form of treatment for athletic injuries. It's used for a variety of hip problems, the most common of which we see is a tear of what we call the labrum. The labrum is a cartilage ring that circles the socket part of the hip. The hip is a ball in a socket joint. Here is a model, part of a pelvis. Here is a hip joint. If I take it apart, you have a ball in a socket. The socket has rimming it a cartilage, tough cartilage ring, like an O-ring, that helps deepen the socket and helps other tissues attach to the hip joint. That area can tear, causing these symptoms. When someone has a tear of torn labrum, some type of athlete, a runner, a worker, most commonly, the complaint is pain in the hip, usually in the groin or on the outer side of the hip. Sometimes a clicking, sometimes difficulty with walking. A special test called an MRI, usually with some type of dye injected, we call it an orthogram, would be scheduled to determine if there is a tear of the labrum. The treatment for that is to either repair or debride, shave, smooth the labrum, depending on the tear or the age of the patient. That's done um, by me at Northeast Surgery Center. It's outpatient surgery under general anesthetic. The important thing to know is that to get the arthroscope, the instruments, into the hip, the surgery is done under traction with some pulling of the leg under x-ray, showing the hip comes apart just enough to do the surgery. Once the surgery is done, the labrum is repaired, or one of the other problems is treated. The recovery includes up to six weeks on crutches, limited activity, probably return to sport in about six months. It's a long healing process. It's a very uh, good operation with a high success rate, particularly in the young athletic population. If there are more questions you want to uh, have answered about this, look into it, discuss hip arthroscopy, feel free to call our office. Uh, the number is 701 4024 Explain to the secretary you have a hip problem, we'd like to talk about hip arthroscopy, um, and I'd be happy to discuss it with you further. Thank you for your attention.